Hello everyone and welcome to the channel. My name is Silver. If you haven't seen come to my channel before, usually I'm a crafter, but I've also been working on a little bit in the background of my Dreamlight Valley stuff. So let me go ahead and I wanted to do a quick walk for a while, not really quick, but a walk through of every biome until the new update happens. Uh, just apologizing here. It looks like in the game itself, you can see we have a little bit of fog, which works out in my favor. But this is actually the plaza. On the right side, we have all of our shopping areas. Made sure to give access to the things that need access. You know what I'm talking about. And this leads toward my little residential neighborhood here. Well, hello, Stitch. Love this little section here. I have to figure out what I want to put in each house, but houses are in place. Let's go toward the right side of the plaza. My Tower of Terror. My favorite ride at Disney, in case anyone was wondering. I have a little entrance way for anyone that comes to visit. I'm still kind of working out how I want this to look, but... Thinking about blocking this section off here so it's only visible from one area, but... Eh. For right now. Then you have the entranceway down to the next biome. And then if we run this way through the trees, we'll actually head down to the beach. I think we'll do that in a minute. Let's head toward the left, excuse me in the way Simba it's fine there is my Disney Disneyfied house here I love how that happens now you could either go this way maybe I couldn't <sighs> I haven't done a cleanup on this side of the island for a while okay call it an island but it's you know here it is all of my pumpkin patches here and if you go this way this is my main house right here. I have that one completely decorated. And if we're going out this way, cool. I love this walkway. Going this way, let's actually head up to the forest. Isn't that cute? have uh mini gave mini a little bit of a uh garden here right next to our house here oh look whose house is that <laughs> i absolutely just love looking through this and then you have goofy who has this own little relaxo area over here <laughs> Stop following me. And then we're going to head more toward the rest of the forest. I have my little like wintry area over here of all the different toys that you can play with and things like that. You have Anna and Olaf's house over here. And then you got Elsa's little entrance right here. That took me the longest time to get almost perfect. But if you look this way, besides all the mess on the ground, you do have you do have Gaston's house over here, and I did make a little 
strong man type of gym over here. <laughs> Which I'm sure he appreciates. Maybe. Probably not. And then before we get to the frozen bile. The rest of the forest. Bundle's tower. Kind of like the way that it looks with the little floating isle behind it. <laughs> All of my iterations of my house that might possibly fit into a foresty area. I do like how that works. All right, and let's us go down to the beach this way. We'll get to the other one, don't worry. Yeah, I wasn't sure where to put him, but this is probably my least decorated area. This is this beach. You have a little cove. That was the first thing I put down, put down I think. I did keep all the little biome things out here. Yes, it was part of the story, but it's just kind of the easiest way to put all these things out of the way somewhere. All right. Trembling through the water. But yeah, if we wanted to come from the cave, the cove here, leads right to Zarek's house. And then behind, we do have... I just enjoy it. I don't know. I made sure to put pathways everywhere, but you do have, because it makes sense to put Prince Eric and then also Ariel. And oh, look, there's Ursula. I will put a little bit of something more in here, but for right now, hmm. I do have to do a cleanup sometime today, but right now, this is how Donald's house looks. I figure, hey, shh, Penelope, I'm making a video. Oh, we got Stitch's house. I still gotta decorate outside of his house, but that's fine. Okay, let's go up to. I mean, the, uh, what is it? We got all these trees in here. You can sit down on the bench. We'll go back up there in a sec. I tried to go nature-y as fast as I can. This is the godmother's house, obviously. Ways. Oh, hey, look. And I'm actually calling this the Toy Story biome. Yeah, Buzz. I'm oh, sorry. Uh, yeah, Buzz and Woody. If you look this way. All of the things. I love it. <laughs> Let us turn around. So this is how the main part of it looks. It took longer than I would like to admit to get both biomes to b b biome and the Toy Story stuff to work together. Let me tell you. And then do you have a little area here for both the lovebirds? You do have your Molly. And they have a garden together, because of course they do, right? And you have Ava over here. And if they really want to, they do have their own water sources and garden. Isn't that cute? I haven't plucked anything in a while, but... Berg, slow down. There we go. And here you are back at the beginning, and lots of area that I still have yet to kind of put little details in, but 
look of Mother Gothel's house, too. I kind of might leave a few things in there, but... And then if you'd like to, you can connect the other biomes over here. All right, and like I promised, let's go back up to... I know I'm pushy with the characters, but they're in my way. We run up here. Oh, look. See the, all, all the houses in there. I have yet to work with the casita a little bit more. I'm going to make more of an entrance for it, but it kind of looks very cool the way it is right now, to be completely frank. I used to have um, Wally's house over here. I'm just running into trees, it's fine. But as you can see, I do have the beast castle in here. Gave myself access to the rocks, but you know, that's neither here nor there. Okay, let's head up to this side once more. We are headed into. Whoa! Now, this is the secondary entrance, as I put it, to the biome up top. Actually, you know what? Let's the main entrance. We'll go back and get that in a minute. But anyway. I figure Scar needed some uh, main character energy for this biome, so. And if we were to follow the pathways, you have two options here. We're to see Goofy. If you look, their way access to get into the cave. And we can go this way. Let's go up here. Eventually we'll put somebody's house in there, but I don't know who's yet. Simba and Nala's house. This tree planting took me a lot longer than I would like to say. <laughs> and then you look through you can see the watering hole and the back side of all of that lots of open space i'm hoping that eventually we do get simone and pumbo because if we do their houses are going to be over there <laughs> i've already pre-planned that out and then i made sure to include some of the biomes next to each other kind of put together here uh -uh. yay and then you do have it leading into Forgotten lands.
I think there's a few things I need to pick up in here, but other than that. I do love the way that looks. That was the latest thing that I've put in. Hopefully at night these will do the bionescent thing that they usually do. The light up thing. Meant to have those lights on for y'all, but... Isn't that cool? <laughs> <laughs> I absolutely love the little touches. Like, and I do have this pathway here. We'll have all of them on in like an hour or so in in game time. So, and then we are back down to the entrance way right here. I just love that it like goes all spooky in here, and then you hit here and it's not so spooky. Okay, now there was one part of the, um, what section was it that I never showed you? Oh, yeah. I was actually going to go ahead and tell you where the entrance way actually begins. It's over here. This one's e just easier to come from the direction that I started decorating and went out from. Absolutely love the way this looks. <laughs> Absolutely amazing. Have your entrance way down there and then down here this is how this looks here on the other end okay so we do have a candy biome over here let's go that way not her collection of games over here Oh, look, there's a couple of houses over here. Not amazing. I just, it took me so long to figure out how to get both of these two houses to mix well together. I And then if you'd like, you can come always down here. Mm. Trying to think of everything. Pathways everywhere. Okay, and there's one area I need to show you. Now you've seen the candy biome. But have you seen the rest of this one? This is so cute. I absolutely loved putting this all together.
Okay, and here we are in the land of the Rith, if you will. When you land, normally there's a lot of miscellaneous stuff hanging around, but this is how mine happens to look for now. Uh, I do have a lot more stuff I need to grind for, but I will have a pathway here. And then I'll have a bunch of trees and everything else hanging in here. And I will have a pathway that leads all the way here. And then you will see a pathway that will lead all the way back to this section over here. I took out most of what was over here <laughs> just because, you know, I can. And then you will see pathway that will lead all the way through. Uh, I have something cooked up over here, but I need, again, need to make the pathing for. But I do have my house pretty much all set and ready to go over here. Lots of open space is pretty much what I wanted for this particular biome here particular section of the game especially. We have walkways all the way back here. I wanted to close off the fact that there's a private beach back there, which we all know it's back there, but I didn't want to make it obvious. Didn't really plan on anything in this valley down here, but this is what it looks like down here. Thinking we need to give Ava a little help with how to decorate down here. But still pretty cute. All right, and I also made a pathway this way on purpose. I will be making lots of pathways going up this way in the middle, but all the trees. I just love like the natural ish look. Do it so letting the biome kind of do what it needs to do normally without the pathway there but and then i did move one of the bigger trees up here at first i was thinking about putting up my house up here and then i realized this area does not have enough room for my house <laughs> but it's still a cool lookout point can see a majority of the area that way that I've decorated so I have a lot of work still to do on this part of the riff but it is what it is I really love these red like flowery trees <laughs> And then I will have a pathway leading to the back biomes part of the section. But what I didn't show you, what was to the left of the entryway, is if we go across this bridge that's here, I'm just about done over here. I have my little shopping area over here. Just need more pathways for that too, but this will be all filled in. Then we'll have little shopping area over here and I built this last night and I was just like oh I'm so proud of this and I don't know why a little bit more natural look here and I think eventually if you would like to you could get back here and do some fishing so then we do have our shops over here i.e. Remy's place and also the shop on its own little island because of course uh, and then I have not done with anything with this little cove that's back there. I think I'm going to try to put something in here, but I'm not sure what yet. Like I said, it depends on who is up next in the update. <laughs> Let us go out to the outside biomes, which I really haven't done much with. Except clear out <laughs> entirely. Near, near, near. Near, near, near. I did clear out quite a bit of this. This is as good as it's gonna stay for now. I 
did, however, open up all the biomes. So let's go ahead and go on to this area here. There's literally absolutely nothing out there except for these two here. I cleared out a majority of the stuff. Um, I had a garden out here at one point. Yeah, yeah it's just <laughs> basically as clear as the eyes can see. Over here, I haven't quite done a good enough job cleaning up and clearing out, but this is just as the areas are all going to be very, very wild. I cannot wait to see what I can do with it. Uh, it's going to take a while. But in the meantime, hey guys for joining me. I will see you guys uh, later on. Have fun in your valley travels, y'all. Hello everyone! Let's just test the microphone settings for that before all the characters decide that they're gonna get them in frame. Alright, well I hope you guys all enjoyed the walkabout. Get out of the way, Minnie. Hope you guys enjoyed the walkabout. I will see you guys later. Bye for now. Okay, so that is the walkabout for the main part of the village. If you look around here, I've got a lot still to clean up, but that's fine. I wanted to show you guys before the new update happens and the picking up takes a lot longer than it should. 